the River Mark will flow through Breda again. The canals to the north and south of the city centre are connected to each other. This creates a blue-green axis in the city. Green Keys investigates how nature can flourish optimally and inclusive along the river. The municipality of Breda wants to realise green walls and keys on the Neuermark River by means of trees on and in the key walls, wall plants and mosses. This not only yields a beautifully overgrown key wall, but also a rich and varied animal life. In the near future, you'll be able to experience nature here as you sail on the River Mark or walk on the keys. What conditions are needed to create a rich plant and animal life between the stones, on the keys and underwater? Eight organisations will investigate this together over the next three years in the European project Green Keys. What exactly are we researching? We use various techniques to find the most optimal conditions for a rich ecosystem both against the vertical key walls and on the keys themselves. We first do this in a small-scale test setup. This setup enables the partners to examine the structure of the wall, the holes, protrusions and cavities in the walls, as well as the types of stone and masonry that are required for the desired nature development. Under bridges and on facades of buildings, places are created that serve as breeding grounds for birds and underwater shelters will be created for fish. On both sides along the river, a number of unique tree sections will be planted as a growing spot for different types of trees and shrubs that enhance the urban ecology. The quay and surroundings thus provide shelter and nesting facilities and provide nectar for insects. The results of the tests are being used to realise green keys along the entire length of the Neuermark River. Green keys, shrubs and trees also contribute to the cooling of the city and combats global warming, a climate-proof design. This project is co-financed by the European Regional Development Fund through the Urban Innovative Actions Programme, UIA.